Hey guys, so we are in New York City and this is our view. We're staying at the Marriott Marquis. Super excited. We're gonna go get dinner, but this is going to be a vlog of this week. So we're on the 32nd floor and there's this weird area where you can like look down. That right there is the eighth floor. We're gonna go up to the roof for dinner. Look at that fitness club. What a weird place to work out. Especially if you like feel super chubby and you don't really want people to look at you while you're working out. I guess this isn't the place to come to work out. Hey guys, so it's Saturday. We are going to breakfast at Friedman's, uh, which is around the corner from our hotel. We just found a Pret a Manger, so we are super excited because I think those are the bomb. And I know that they're old news for everyone in England, but uh, yum. I'm apparently crying. Um, <laughs> I'm so excited about Pret a Manger. No, <laughs> the wind is making me cry. Um, anyway, today I think we might go to FIT, but they had a lockdown yesterday on their uh, school because they had a school shooting incident, apparently. So we're gonna go first. And then if not, I don't know what we're gonna do. I'll find out with my friends. Oh, there's Waitress. It's really weird to stay in the theater district because of where you go. Like our hotel hosts Hamilton. So it's crazy. Anyway, I'll let you know what we get up to. Okay, 
Okay, so we just got out of this fabric and fashion thing and I was not allowed to record video in there. Rad. So I have a bunch of pictures and I will put them up on the screen now. For you guys to see, so you can see all the stuff that was in there. We also went into this exhibitionism situation and I will put those up also for you to look at. Okay, so now we're going to the Museum of Illusion. Illusions, Illusions Michael. Michael. <laughs> Those of you who have seen Arrested Development, that's very funny. For the rest of you, probably not. Failed mission. We uh, got there and there's a really long line and we don't really have time for that. And also, I think it's just like a like selfie place. We might go there later, we'll see. Uh, so we're just sort of walking around New York City today, checking things out. Uh, yeah, so we have a performance of Network tonight, which is starring Brian Cranston. Uh, that starts at seven, so we have to, <laughs> nice dude, um, get there by like slightly before seven until we need to eat earlier and blah 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 so anyway we're 30 blocks from home so we're gonna walk back to go see Brian Cranston. So that was awesome. Did you like Brian Cranston? Brian Cranston was awesome. It was all awesome. Can't even tell if they can hear me over this bus. Anyway, uh, network was really, really good. I weirdly have a friend whose cousin apparently helped produce that show, so good on Eric's cousin. Anyway, uh, we're just gonna go get subway passes now. It's like 11 o'clock at night. Wait. It's 1024. We're gonna get some water for the room and then go to bed. So tomorrow we're going to brunch with some friends. And then we're gonna go to the Met. And then what's our play for tomorrow night? Um Bushes. No, that's Monday. Um anyway, it should be a fun day. Uh, we have a play every night but Thursday night so far. Although that might change. Mean girls. Oh mean girls. Well Tina Fade tomorrow night, so. Hopefully that's awesome. Okay, anyway, see you guys tomorrow. Good morning. I am freshly showered. And some weird hair. Um, we are going to go see my friend Greg in Brooklyn. We've never taken the subway to Brooklyn. So we're gonna give this a go and see how that goes. Um, also, I figured out last night at 2.30 in the morning, <coughs> I forgot the tickets to the place that we're supposed to go to. Two sets of them. So after that, we're gonna go to the theaters and see if they'll reprint our tickets for us. I don't know, <laughs> but we'll find out. Anyway, wish us luck. And now we're at the Met. We did get one of our ticket issues resolved and they gave us hope that the other one will be fine too, so. That's great that the box office isn't open today, so we'll try again tomorrow. Anyway, Thank you so much. these are what the beautiful apartments by Central Park looks like. So we're going to go check out the Met and see what's going on in there.
Okay, so night number two is the Mean Girls show, which looks completely blown out. By the way, if you're ever in New York, uh, we went to this place called Victor's Cafe. Um, it's Cuban food, and I think I heard about it from someone on YouTube. Anyway, it's fantastic, and I highly recommend it. Would suggest. That was awesome. Highly recommend Mean Girls. That was a great musical. If you guys like the movie, definitely go see that. I got a t-shirt. I don't buy t-shirts and stuff anymore, because I have too many t-shirts. And I got a t-shirt, so I really liked it. Highly recommend. What are we doing tomorrow? We're gonna go to the Cloisters. Uh, which is part of the Met. I, I don't even know what that is because to me that's a religious thing. Um, and then we have to go <laughs> try to get our Beetlejuice tickets because um, I screwed up. And then, uh oh, this thing. I'm going in the circle thing. Um, yeah, we're gonna go to the Cloisters, go to get Beetlejuice tickets, maybe go back to the Met because Chris wants to go back. Um, and then tomorrow night is Beetlejuice. Am I on the wrong side? I'm on the wrong side. I don't know where I'm going. This hotel's moderately confusing. All right, see you guys tomorrow. What up, peeps? I am now currently in the cloisters. I thought this was some religious situation because that's how I know what cloisters are. We can keep walking. Um, but no, that is not what's happening. Okay, this is what's happening. We're going up there. This is all Manhattan, people. Things I didn't know. It's all the way at the what, north end? Yep, Inwood. North end of Manhattan. So we're gonna go see what the view's like. And I will show you when we get up there. Okay, over there is New Jersey. Right. Everything is legal there. And everybody's an asshole. <laughs> there is the George Washington Bridge. I don't know what that thing is. It's pretty. Let me zoom. That thing. And what you're hearing is the West Side, West Side Highway, which is down there. Okay, we are in the cloisters. Still looks like a nunnery. And there's a lot of Jesus going on in here. Yeah, they keep telling me this is a military building, but I'm like, um, super confused by this then. Okay, I got the information. This place was built to be a museum. It was never military and it was built to be, look like a medieval cloister. <clears throat> I got the info.
I got a new mattress because my mattress is really crazy in my hotel room, so they brought me a new mattress. I thought it was just gonna change rooms, but no. Um, we went to dinner just now at this place called Brasso 56 on, unsurprisingly, 56th Avenue. No, 56th Street, sorry. Avenues are different than streets. And now we're going to see the Beatles, Beetlejuice musical. I'm very, very excited about this. Okay, here is the Beetlejuice Theater. It looks amazing. I am super excited, ready for this business. And I'll let you know how it is when it's over. So Beetlejuice was good. The second half, half was not as good as the first though. Um, I did like it and I bought all the merch. <laughs> um, it's totally different than the movie. As you can see, I'm back at the Met. We are gonna go look at some stuff this morning for a couple hours and then we're gonna have a secret surprise today. So these are the guitars of, you know, the Beatles and Jimi Hendrix. And I think this one is Van, Eddie Van Halen's guitar. This one is Jimi Hendrix's guitar. This one is Jimmy Page's guitar. Allman Brothers are over here. There's like Joni Mitchell's guitar. Uh, Aerosmith. The Back in Black, or uh, ACDC's Back in Black guitar, and then Aerosmith's um, Walk This Way guitar is there. So we're in this exhibit in the Met talking about guitars. They have the Beatles drum kit. I'm gonna find that for you. And guitars. These are some of these are actually Beatles things too. Anyway, it's pretty awesome. This is the back of Eric Clapton's guitar. It just proves that like the body of the guitar doesn't matter at all, almost. This is Metallica's kit. That's James Hetfield's guitar. Lars. Robert. Better shot of Kirk's guitar. Unsurprisingly, flea space. For those of you into Sonic Youth, there's the bass from Sonic Youth. Show Crow's uh, oh, acoustic bass is over here. This is the kit of the roots. <laughs> This is the clarinet of Patti Smith, and this is Ian Anderson of Jethro Tull's flute. This is Ravi Shankar's sitar, and this is an electric sitar. This was used by the Steve Miller Band, by Steve Miller. Here's Lady Gaga's piano. And of course, Prince. And then there was this. Broadway. I mean, I've been going to Broadway all week. Uh, we're going to see backstage, behind Broadway, to see uh, backstage at, uh, at Aladdin. Bernadette says that I can maybe film, so we'll see. 
If not, I'll take some pictures and disclaimer. then I'll put them in here. We'll put a disclaimer that this video, Noelle's channel, myself, my own channel, nothing is affiliated with Disney Theatrical. Other than I give Disney half my paycheck <laughs> well, <true>. every <laughs> single month. So, yeah. yeah. Okay, <laughs> we'll see you there. <laughs> This is the stage from the side wings. Oh, go out onto the stage. It's a much cooler. Start spreading the news. Check it out. I'm on stage on Broadway. Now I can say that I've done it. Bucket list complete. Next. Same as you. Yeah. <laughs> if anybody wants pictures, you know, I'll be your camera person. interact with the shops get them to make the clothes bring them things that they need you source fabric and stuff yeah that's yeah, awesome yeah. yeah and help the designer with it Jafar's oh, no staff Probably. here it is so. so we've got day workers that come in and so it's done in order of track I'm not going to touch anything because it's all very specifically yeah. ordered based on when you need to go on stage but there's the marketplace ladies here, oh, and they go into their attendance, their wedding look. They're very quickly digitized, mm -hmm. and now it's printed, which is yeah. good because now we can print however many, mm -hmm. you know. And that's they're printed right in their pattern shapes in the actor's side. That's really so smart. just be sent wow. off to the costume shop, oh. be whipped together. So these are all, well, these are a selection of men's hats, just for Prince Ali and Fred Lightning. Oh my god. <laughs> so look at that one. This, this was an interesting situation in which we came back from Toronto which was the out of town tryout and all the hats were sort of just lined up in a section of the design studio the designer's just sitting there one day and says oh you know that, I think we need to make these hats a little bit more sparkly so it became a process in tech None, pretty much well some of the bigger these things existed on the hats but a lot of the rhinestoning like all of this rhinestoning was not a thing so oh, wow. it was me and two of our interns, um, one, well, sort of the associate, but he had better things to be doing, but, you know, the three of us in tech, usually in the evenings from about 6 to like 1 a.m., sitting at our little table with our little tiny light, <laughs> just hot fixing crystals to these hats for like two weeks. That's wow. crazy. It was a good time. It was a very good time. Did you hear? Yeah, yeah, unless they're quick changing, then the wardrobe staff will bring their clothes up. They're all jumpsuits. Yeah, they're all jumpsuits. Seconds. Yeah, yeah. This is the men's changing area. The men, do they people everybody dress themselves, or are there people off hand off stage? There's uh, dressers. Wow. The help because especially with quick changes, it's a lot. Oh. Oh. Thing here. Oh. So they're all custom done by Laduca and Tio Day, who are local cobblers. Well, actually, Laduca sourced out to Italy, but. And they managed to get that many shoes done that quickly. Oh yes, absolute wizardry. Wow. Because everyone's got different choreography based yes. on where they are on stage. Wow. Well, these folks, their costumes are very nice and pretty because they don't have to go on every night. Mm. <laughs> they all look pretty from 20 feet away. Oh yes, yeah, that's true. That's all that matters. Yeah, mm -hmm. you're 20 feet away. Yep, yep. <laughs> Random wow. costuming in the basement. We're standing in the stairs. Swing costumes. Olive. She's a ghost. She's one of the big girls. I supposedly by accident before you were a ghost. Yeah. I hope it's still, but I never. Yeah, apparently she still haunts the theater. A green beaded dress wow. holding a green glass bottle. Except wow. Stage hands the Ziegfeld Follies was apparently in this theater, and it is one of the oldest theaters on Broadway. These are some of the Ziegfeld Follies girls. Amongst the Agrabah scenery, very <laughs> fitting. And here we are in Agrabah. Okay. And we'd be like, oh, that's not that hot. It's hot there yes. because you cannot cool yes, off. you can't cool off. Yeah, no ice. No. <laughs> can't get a drink of ice in there. No. <laughs> that was awesome. We had a really good time. 
It's nice to see Bernadette, and I will see her again later this week. We're gonna go fabric shopping on Thursday. Yep, Thursday. Uh, we had a also tasty meal at Gyukaku, but it was at 4.15, so it was abrupt a bit early. Um, so we have an hour and 45 minutes to kill before we go, and there's some crazy stuff going on here. Um, before we go to see the prom tonight, which is our Broadway show of choice tonight. And uh, so we're gonna go to the Nintendo store. So apparently they have cool stuff that is exclusive to the New York, New York store. And we all have Switches and really enjoy our Nintendos. with the line so I'm gonna go deal with that but this has been your Broadway update for today hey guys it's Wednesday I'm up and freshly showered we're gonna go to lunch and then we're gonna go to the Harry Potter play and then we're gonna go to dinner and then we're gonna go to the Harry Potter play because <laughs> it's two parts so um, I'm not gonna bring my camera today because I, there's nothing to show you really I mean I'll take a picture of the outside thing and I might take a little video on my cell phone or whatever but I don't think they allow cameras in there anyway so I think I'm just gonna leave this here today so I'll pick you guys up tomorrow and I'll leave whatever I do get here what up peeps I got beeps <laughs> uh, we're see that's what I mean by the most California thing ever <laughs> uh, we are in the fabric district what do you guys call this fashion district garment district garment district everybody has a different name for it um, we're going shopping. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna film this as a different video because this vlog is getting insane So I'll link you down to that video below or when it goes live or whatever. I'm not sure how these are gonna go up um, so I'll film a recap for this channel at the end and maybe give you some highlights We're in Times Square Walk into Kang Ho Dong uh, Korean barbecue. That stuff is awesome, by the way. Um, they have Kang Ho Dongs like all over the world. There's one in LA, there's one here, I think there's one um, in Tokyo. Go there if you can. It's awesome if you like Korean barbecue. So we ate there in LA and we're gonna go there tonight for dinner because it's the one night we don't have a theater thing going on. We looked at the theater things, but there was other stuff we could have seen for sure, but nothing was like so compelling that we couldn't not do it, you know? So we decided to chill and like have a nice evening and spend time on dinner instead of rushing all the time. So I've only had an egg today. Oh, and a piece of mango, and I had a pan, pan of chocolate. That is my totality of dinner, and it's like seven. So I am ready for some Korean barbecue. Miracle on 34th Street, anyone? Look at these windows. We are over meated though. We've had too much meat. I don't really want meat ever again. Until tomorrow, we're gonna have more meat. <laughs> I'm sure. We're looking at either pub food, because someone wants Tucker's pie, or French food. We're not sure which yet. Um, we're at a slow crawl right now. And we are heading back towards our hotel. Um, back to Broadway and 34th Street, which is not where our hotel is, but where Macy's is. Which reminds me of that movie, Miracle on 34th Street. Um, which is just a giant ad, actually, for Macy's. Anyway, um, I think we're gonna do a little 
shoppy shop now for a little bit. So yeah, is that what we're doing, Bubs? Yeah. yeah. Uh, and then have a chill evening. Oh, we could go see Shazam. Okay. We'll see. We'll see what happens. Good morning on Friday. Um, we are gonna go to the subway and take the train to the Natural History Museum where we will hang out for a little bit, check out the dinosaurs. As you do, I'm only ever there for the dinosaurs. Like, I don't really care about all the other stuff stuff. But any one time I can go see dinosaurs as well. So we're gonna do that and then we're gonna go to Grand Central maybe um, so Chris can check it out and take some photos and stuff. And then we're gonna come back for dinner, although we just ate lunch, so we can have the cheese plate. Um, and then we're gonna go see Kiss Me Kate tonight. So we got a big day planned of running all over the city. So hopefully it will be awesome.
Hey guys. So National History Museum was fun, and now then we went and had food. It was not very good. Don't go to Pig and Whistle. Um, now we're going into Kiss Me Kate, and I'm walking in, so I gotta go. Hey guys, it's Saturday. So uh, Kiss Me Kate was awesome. There is this song that has been stuck in my head for like five or ten years, so I must have seen it like a little bit more than that. And <laughs> and this song stuck in my head. And now I know where it's from, and that's very gratifying because I've been singing it to one of my coworkers for quite some time now. Um, anyway, uh, we just came back from that last night and then went, watched a lot of Sabrina the Teenage Witch and then went to sleep. This TV has Netflix on it. Um, yeah, so we're just flying home today. So we have a car coming to get us at 2. It's like almost noon. Um, so we're just gonna go get some breakfast and then head to the airport, um, so, yay. Uh, we had a really great time in New York and thank you for watching this vlog. If you liked it, give it a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed, please do. Normally this channel is full of sewing videos, um, but I thought you would enjoy this. Anyway, I hope you guys are having a great day and I will see you guys next time with another video. Bye guys!